Welcome in, ladies and gentlemen. We got Johnny back with the elite breakdown on how to select your center backs in FIFA 22. What is the best way to do this? I got you, homies. I got you, homies. And we're gonna throw some, a few, just a little bit of some background music for you guys. But guys, if you like this type of content, make sure you guys like, follow, and do all that good stuff. And basically, guys, I've created a filter, and this is the really quick way about it: high work rate, center backs, space, reactions, marking, strength. Now, those are the biggest, biggest factors. Now. Some players can play very well without this high work rate, like VVD. VVD actually does not have the high work rate, um, but he is extremely dominant due to his size, his sheer size, his aggression. All the, I mean, it's VVD, right? And so that's why you're seeing a lot of pros in that community. But here, these are the best center backs for their value when it comes to most balance between everything. This is pace, reactions, marking, strength. Now, these guys are all the minimums that I require whenever I'm selecting a team. And so, would I play with Roger Ibanez da Silva? Yes, yes, I would. Would I play with Jean of Rotongen? Yes, yes, I would. Would I play with Diego Carlos? Yes. Would I play with Christian Romero? Yes. Would I play with these guys? Yes, I would. I would play with all these players. If I was selecting like a draft, if I was selecting, you know, like a really cheap team, if I was trying to just make a unique connection for like a quick, uh, quick starter match or whatnot i would be playing with all these players now there are some highlighted players like jules kunde kimpembe uh rujano uh, varain is all good screeniar is actually very underrated one of the better ones marquinhos these guys are all seen in the high in the high level fifa quite a bit quite a bit and the reason why is because they are the most balanced that you can find and i made the filter for you guys so now you all you have to do is plug and play and the more selective you want to be with this filter from here if you want to you know if you want to change that from 75 pace so let's uh let's let's boost it up to 80 right let's boost it up to 80 now who's new now who's left now we we dropped off a few people right and but now we have kunde print and oh it's crazy but all the players that you see in, in elite fifa a majority of them right here however the only one that i probably don't see in this is vvd and that's why i wanted to talk about him but kunde kimpembe boom there's a combo there you know you've got kunde you've got uh you've got kunde and you've got you know marquinhos maybe not be able to pair those but you might be able to get you know right back with them or whatnot and so you know, Koulibaly, uh, you could probably get Di Natale with them. You know what I mean? So there's unique squad builds, but these are the players and these are the filters. Okay, so if you guys ever need help and you guys want to know how to find these type of players and you guys need to know how to find and go in and implement this type of content, you guys know where to find me. My name is Johnny and I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you ever want to see me again, make sure you hit that subscribe button because I give all these type of tips. I give all these type of tips. I'll be about forty thousand on the uh, on our other on our other platform, but come back, guys, and hit me up on the in the comments below if you guys have any questions or if you like to see a different video or on anything else. Just ask me a question; I'll make a video on it. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.